Hi, I'm Anna, CPS State from Tackle. In this video, I'll show you how to install a Nuna Rabo convertible car seat in the rear facing position using a seat belt. If your child weighs 40 pounds or more, the calf support needs to be used. Recline your base to the desired rear facing position. To get to the install base, do the following steps first. Flip the cup holders into the used position. Loosen the straps by pushing on the button in the bottom of the base and pulling on top. Next, unbuckle the harness and move away the metal tongues into the buckle holders. Raise the headrest to its highest position. Remove the buckle cushion and pull the fabrics off to reveal the install base. Open up the rear facing true tension door. Pull on your vehicle seat belt and put the shoulder and lap belt portions together. Route the seat belt through the cup holder and underneath the tension doors. Buckle the seat belt. Push down on the bottom of the base and with other hand pull the slack out of the seat belt. Push down on the tension doors until they close completely. Lock your switchable retractor by pulling it out all the way and letting it go slowly. The ratcheting indicates that the seat belt is only getting shorter. You need to make sure that you lock your vehicle seat belt because the tension door is not a locking device. Put your covers back on and the headrest into a desired position. After you're done installing, make sure that your seat doesn't move more than an inch at the belt back. Make sure that your side impact protection pillow is out and engaged at the side closest to the doors. Your tether strap should be properly stored when you're using this car seat in a rear facing position. If you have any questions about a Nuna Rava or any other car seats, feel free to email us, call us, or stop by, and we'll be happy to help you. Thanks for watching.